Hello, good day. This is Alex. Today we are going to cover define Excel table. What is Excel table and what is the advantage of Excel table? So in this file here, is this an Excel table? Many of my students say yes, it's an Excel table. You have row and columns nicely arranged. But to Excel, this is not an Excel table. So what is the Excel table and how to convert it? An easy way will be at the home tab here, you can see here format as table and the shortcut here is you can use control L or control T. So when you create as an Excel table, it will automatically select the data. So if you're table have the header you just tick my table has header if your data do not have a header you can just untick this one okay so mine have the header so i will tick this so you can see it automatically format into a very nice format where it have a intermittent rows that you can see easily and it will come up with a new ribbon here for the excel table so one of the advantage is the theme, the color scheme. Another one advantage is when you insert a formula, let's say for this total sales, we insert a sum. Okay, so we insert a sum here. In normal Excel, if you want to change this formula, you will need to retype it. But in the Excel table, if you have a formula, you can click this drop down menu and you can easily change the numbers. Let's say you want the average, it can automatically change to average. You want the maximum or you want the minimum. So that is one advantage. Another advantage is, let's say after we sort all these things by division. Okay, after we have sort, and for some reason, you want these few rows to appear on top. Okay, so in Excel table, you can just highlight the rows, click, and then drag, and release. So this will be removed there. So if you want to move to the part, so you can easily rearrange the rows of the data or the columns of the data so this is excel table so just in case in one day you do not wish it to be excel table anymore you can select your table go to design and you can convert it back to range click yes so now this go back to range not excel table thanks for watching